Alrighty everyone, it's time to jump into Sway's desktop software. This software will help you create your own custom presets for your Sway device, which are completely launchable via the Sway preset buttons. All right, first things first, we wanna make sure that this Sway icon is purple. This represents that Sway is connected. Once Sway is connected, let's jump straight into it. As we can see on the left hand side, we have our layouts tab. These represent all the different types of layouts that we can load onto Sway. Here we have a four x three note grid, which looks a little something like this. And over here we have a two axis motion tracking mode which looks a little something like this. What you'll notice is our layouts are combinations of the two. For example, here we have an X and Y tracking area on the left and note grids on the right. This allows us to play notes whilst using Sculpt to modulate. Here we have a three by three note grid and a singular column tracking which allows us to play a larger range of notes while controlling a CC with up and down movement. Okay what you will also notice is on this right hand side we have our colors. This allows us to pick the colors of the LEDs. We can either have one complete color or we can have a certain gradient which changes as we move up and down. For example from red to green. Now you'll also notice that we have an instrument settings tab. This allows us to change notes, octaves, to implement chords and of course our expressive features. Now what you'll notice is from the grids to the multi-dimensional tracking, we have different settings. For our multi-dimensional tracking, we are able to change the horizontal CC as well as the vertical. Now let's bring the focus to these buttons here. Scroll through each button, we can make changes to the respective preset. For example, if I want to change the second preset, I want to make sure that I have clicked on the second preset within the software. You will also notice this little tab here. This allows us to scroll through the different banks of presets. As you can see, we can create up to 36 unique presets. Now you're probably wondering, how can we scroll through the different banks from Sway's interface? For example, if we long press the second button, we will access a completely new batch of presets, as well as third, fourth, and so on. Awesome, you are now ready to get started with your Sway software. Have fun.